What's up guys? Welcome to the London Aquatic Centre. We have finally got the man himself to Yay. come back. World champion. World champion as yeah. well. Congratulations. Thank you very much. Mr. Tom Daly. Hello. Thank you so much for coming back on the channel. So many people yeah. have been asking you to teach us to dive. So I hope you're ready because that 10 meter is the height of two double-decker buses and a car piled on top of each other and you two are going to be going we up. Are going you up like it. it or not? I'm a little nervous. I'm not John's gonna lie. a little <laughs> nervous. You guys can stop this video right now and write a comment below saying yes we're going to be able to do it or no we're not going to be able to do it. But we need to go and get some speedos on yeah. and get this underway. Yeah. Let's go. Tom, how, well, do we, how do we look? I mean, you look the part, but I don't think we're going to need these or these for the diving. We're going to start on the one meter, start from the bottom, and work our way all the way up there to the 10 meter board. Oh, yeah. there you go again with that 10 meter work. 10 yeah. meter malarkey today. Not to 35 miles an hour in 1.5 seconds. So, welcome to Tom Cam. This is going to be fun. We're going to be trying to get them off of the 10 meter board. The question is, are they actually brave enough? They're giving it all the large beans, saying that they're going to be able to get off the 10 meter, but it's a long way down. We shall see. So now that they have done the one meter already, we're now going up onto the three meter platform. How did you find one? Yeah, it was all right. It Good. Was, um, sounds really stupid and naive, but a lot more technical than I thought, because normally I'm like a proper run off the end cannonball kind of guy. Yeah, you've got to have control to go off the, off the 10 meter. So this is three meters. It's not even half. So it's, we're, yeah, just less than a third of the way. And this is what we're looking at. It's oh, hard to shit. see how high it is on the camera. Quite loose. Both absolutely fine, both ready to go to the next level, which is the five meter. But Leon did have a little bit of backward rotation, so if he's not careful, he's going to get a lot of water in places that he does not want to get water. <laughs> so he's going to have to sort that out for the next level. But up to five, are you ready for five meter? Yes, do it. So, how's this one looking? A lot higher. I thought that was the 10 meter and I saw that one sticking out the top. That is a long way. So we're halfway now. That's a long way. That's a long way. Oh. 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 How is that? <laughs> That's not bad. She started, because you ran to it a little bit, you had a bit of a, a rotation. Off, Can I go, yeah? Whenever you're ready. One movement of the head will make you the go that way or go that way. So just try and, try and keep it a bit more neutral. So that is now the five meter complete. They're halfway to the 10 meter board now. So we're gonna move on up to the 7.5 meter, three quarters of the way, and see if they can manage to land the right way up to then progress to the top board, which is the 10 meter. So they've now completed three quarters of the mission. So the next one is the 10 meter up there behind me. They might experience a little bit of a knacker knocker if they're not careful. They have to make sure that they're in perfect control for that moment when they leave the board till they hit the water. Because if they lose control, they lose balance. It's gonna hurt. There's John setting up the camera all the way over there. John, you look absolutely tiny. It's a lot higher than it looks from down there, that's for sure. Especially because you can't get any perspective, but when you've got John stood there and you know he's six foot tall, yeah. it suddenly makes you go, oh, he looks like a hobbit. Well, to think that that over there is a 50 meter pool. Yeah, it looks like a little. little it looks like pool. a, yeah, it does. So they are ready to go now up here on the 10 meter, and I am going to show you what it looks like from Tom Cam. So, are you ready? Yeah. 
I'm absolutely pure myself. I'm not even pretending I'm not. No, I've not seen that look on your face for a while. <laughs> the last time I went myself on the test, I leaned over. You won't do it again, that's what I've done on the five. You got this. Are you all good to go? You're good to go. Yes! Good one! Definitely a very proud teacher here, proud coach. They went off the 10 meter and they did so well. They managed to just do it without even thinking about it. They were off the end and they were into the water. No injuries so far. But now it's time to learn how to dive head first. But now it's time to learn how to dive head first. So now that you're warmed up and you're in the water, yeah. we're going to make you the next GB synchronized <laughs> diving team. Yeah. Are you ready? Have you seen my there? rhythm in the belly flop Olympics? I bet he got no coordination. None. Zero. We'll have to work on that. But we'll get you going off one meter in synchro. Let's All do right. it. Level one. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> About halfway between the second and third line, yeah. that's when you're gonna aim for. You got it. And just fall and stretch towards it. Lift up on your toes and just fall. Stretch. So they managed to get off of the five meter doing the pike fall, which is a pretty good achievement. It did look like they did a couple of scorpion spinals when they hit the water, because they were changing direction when they hit the water, but they've done a good job. All in a day's work. So apparently we're now GB divers. How do we do, Tom? You did great. Like, I'm actually genuinely pretty impressed with you. Is there such thing as like a triplet Synchro diver, like a I don't know, like a trinkro. We it's should make that like trinkro. That that needs to happen, and we can go in the next Olympics. <laughs> hey, we're the, the new GB trinkro team. There you go, it's done. Nice you saw it here first. <laughs> so make sure, guys, you head over to Tom's channel. I'll put a link below. Check out his channel. It's absolutely awesome. Tom, you've got honeymoon a little bit of time off. Now. Yes, I'm off on honeymoon now and Amazing. break, and I don't have to get back in there for like another three weeks, so I'm happy about that. Amazing, <laughs> well thank you so much for having us, mate. It's no, always fun to hang out, out with you, and awesome. I got a lot of respect for what you do, and that was a lot of fun, and I, mate, how hard is that It was, be? it was super hard. You'll never, you can never really relate until you've tried it. So if you've got somewhere like this near you, give it a bash, if not, Give Tom a little knock and I'm sure we'll be able to get you into one <laughs> yeah, of his I'll academies. Yeah, give you all diving lessons, don't worry about that. <laughs> don't forget to subscribe to the channel, guys. Thank you so much. If you loved it, give it a massive thumbs, thumbs up, up and we'll see you next week. Bye, guys. Yeah! That was great! 
Yeah. <laughs>